for, you know, just all the work that's gone on. Yeah, they've been building for this over a number of years, and, um, yeah, oh, it's great, great to see. Marlon and also uh, and also the number three Chrissy Jones is uh, uh, Troy Rose is in the uh, the tackle. There's tackle too concerned about him. It was just the way they popped their heads up straight away and looked over to the sideline. Yeah, he might have had a bit of a knock mark and um, he's a bit groggy. They're bringing him straight off. They go uh, they move on on tackle three. They go for a long pass to the left hand side and the ball's on the ground and it's picked up by the number by Tom Yo and he sends it out to Chrissy Jones on the right hand side and they're flying towards the touch line. I think. I think. I think they might have scored here, Dunny Do. Looking, Mick Dries. He's going to call the try. Gee, that was a break of play, wasn't it, Dinger? They've just gone to the left hand side, Canamble. Yep. And uh, they've still got a couple of tackles left in the set. They're going to go the short side, are they? They're going to show the little oh, dummy really? inside ball to Marlin. And he's crashed over. Uh, he's crashed over. I don't know. He's looking. Mick Dries will let you know. At eight points to nil. Uh, the Dunny Do swans over the Canamble Bears. Sheets, eight points to nil and three penalties to Dunny Do and two to Canamble. We're just waiting on the conversion here. Kieran's lining up and here it goes. It's in the air and wow. oh, he's made it. He's so I can't try and get over the line. Ten points to nil. The Dunny Do Swans over the uh, Canamble Bears here at Robinson Oval. Here they go to the right hand side of the field. Oh. Welcome, makes his way in. Ah. Ah. Makes his way in. Uh, just waiting for the referee to uh, award maybe another Dunny Do try. And yeah. there it is. Uh, he looks like Dan Trengrove, except bigger. Has a little bit of a stoush. Oh, Mitt Squires. Oh, he's kicked the ball. It's come off a Canamble player. Here goes Troy Rose down the left hand touch line. Oh, but he's yeah. made it in. So Mitch Squires, nothing happening. He's kicked the ball with a little try, chip over the top type thing. It's come off the Canamble uh, player. So uh, it's... We can just give you, while we're a bit of a lull in the thing, um, there's been tries to Troy Rose, Ryan Marlin, Chrissy Jones, Chris Walkham. You know, there's been a few balls going to ground and that, and, um, yeah. But so here they friendly. go, through the, Morrissey's through the middle of the pack, but, oh, just stopped short there by Stanford. Sorry, Dinger, didn't mean to cut you no, off. You're right, mate. I thought he was in. Pickering's got the ball. They go to the left-hand side of the field through Smith, uh, and he crashes now. over. He crashes over for the try. So uh, just waiting for, yep, there it is. So 24 points to four. Canamble back in the game. So here for the 2014 Castle Raid League. Uh, the group with that. Uh, so they're going to go to the left-hand side. A uh, little uh, chip Charge kick there. Charge Comes down. off. Blah. You know what? Mm. I think Chrissy Jones is going to score this. Oh, bad luck for Canamble yet again. He scored it. It's 24 points to uh, nil. So that's just another kick from uh, Mitchell Squires, I think it was. Yeah, He's charged down back to Dunny Doo and back to uh, Chrissy Jones, I think. Back yeah. to Chrissy Jones, and that's just a gift. Four points to the line, so this is the last tackle. So there goes Pickering, and he sends it belting down side, downstairs, and... Uh, and Tyson Searle's got it, the number two for Dunny Doo, and he's got it on the 20-metre line. He's muppet over the 20-metre line, and he bas bashes his way back to the 30-metre line. What, 10 metres out? Not even that. Seven metres out right in front of the post. They're going to try their big buffeting runs there, the number 12 from Canamble. He's going to be held up. He's playing for a try. This is going to be very close to see. He's called it. Try to Canamble. Uh, 10, 24 points to 10. About 12 minutes to go in the Castle Ray League Group 14 uh, Grand Final. So that was uh, that was a great uh, was that the pullback. No, I think it was. Uh, I'm going to call it out. He back off. It was just an act here today. <laughs> You're being up and down that field. So here goes Troy Rose. He's got the ball and he's showing and going and he's beaten oh, two, yeah. three. He's down over the 20 metre line. I don't think they're going to stop him this time. Big Troy Rose goes in for second. That'll be all she wrote. I'd say. I'd say. Yep. So big drives calls the try. So Troy Rose just got the ball. He threw a dummy. He palmed one off. And he just said, give it to me, put the afterburners on. So that'll take it to uh, 20, 28 points to 12. The ball. Here goes uh, Bruce. They go to the right-hand side. Walkham looks outside for Jones. He's got the ball. He shows and goes. And here goes Tyson Searle in the corner. Here goes Tyson Searle in the corner. Scores the try. Scores the try. That's about, uh, that's just a copybook backline movement. You could, you could see it. You could see it. Chris Jones was absolutely screaming yep. for the ball out in the right-hand touchline. And uh, Chrissy Walkham looked, uh, looked like he was going to hold on to it for a while, but he yep. seemed...